Good morning everybody, how are we all doing? It is Friday, thank goodness for that. Um, next week I will be back to doing my videos like I said previously. Um, so I'll do a day in front, so when I do a video Monday you'll see it on Tuesday. I kind of forgot about all that this week. I'm absolutely exhausted this morning. Um, Livy's been up and down all night again and face is slowly going down a little bit but I'm going to have to take her to the uh, the appointment today and get her checked out because she's going to open her mouth so yeah I'm out of sleep I'm just sat having a cup of tea I'll step me out I know I need a shower but right now I haven't got the energy <laughs> I just popped the top over my BJ's uh, bottoms because I had to let the dog out and I get embarrassed walking around the street I'd walk, get past walking out and around. Anybody sees me in beaches. I'm not that type of person. I mean, if it's dark and one of the kids needs shop, I'll, I'll run quickly run in the car and then sink out whilst they go. Other than that, no. I don't know how people do it. Nothing wrong with that, like going to the shops with your PJs on, but it's just not me. I, I just can't do it. Um, anyway, guys, sit back, relax copper or whatever you are drinking right now and let's get on with this hi guys so just want to say because i forgot happy birthday to one of my subscribers uh john happy birthday i'm not gonna sing because i can't sing for love the money and i don't want to embarrass myself anyhow so today, I did have it in a ponytail, but it looked like a, a looked like a, you know, when cats get a fright and that's the tail, that's what it looked like. Anyway, so, just giving Olivia some medication. Actually, a face on one side is going down a little bit. I'm going to give the cat some of this. One second. I highly recommend this. Um, I got it from Mew and Friends of Amazon. Only about six pounds something, or short seven quid anyway. It's organic. It's I'm I'm being gifted this or anything like that. Look, I've got it out, and even cats are starting already. They're starting already. Aren't you, Ronnie? I have to put it up high because. Oh no! One second, guys. Oof. Sorry, I have to separate the cats at the minute. So Bella and the baby kitten are in Anna's room. Ronnie and so is in um, Kitty Prison right now because yeah he's been a naughty boy. One second, guys, look, he's in a cat prison. <laughs> and then I've got Ronnie on the floor. Hey now, so happy birthday, John! I hope you have a fantastic day. I'm just going to go and put some moisturiser on my face because look at the state of me this morning and whew, catch my breath. Uh, my pain levels are high even though you probably don't think it. This is what I don't understand guys. Listen, one second because I've got a duster. This is what I don't get because people, look at me. You won't think, ah that me. You won't think nothing wrong with me. I'm absolutely knackered. My arms, oh, everything is hurting me. Even my backside is hurting me because I can't sit for too long. I can't stand for too long. And yeah, I'll catch up with you in a bit. Oh my goodness gracious me, I finally, well not I finally, but finally, things are getting taken seriously. Now I've just seen a clip of, I'm not going to say what hospital it is, but it's to do with mental health. Finally, they're taking notice of it. Finally, 
taking notice that the mental health system is needing help. The state of the hospital. So, long story short, about a year or two ago, in fact, no, it was back in, I'd say 2020, coming into 2021, I needed to be in hospital for my mental health. I really did. I was really bad, depression, uh, all these negative, unaliving thoughts, etc., etc. And I'm not, I'm not lying when I say it is the worst hospital I've ever seen. Now, they have cleaners in and out all morning and then they come back around in the afternoon. I don't know why they bother because it was so filthy. Now, me and you guys, whoever does your housework, you either hoover if you've got a carpet or you sweep if you've got lavender. Now, I sometimes sweep, but then I still need to hoover because of dog hair. However, that's what it was like in the hospital. They'd use one of them mop things, sweep all the dust out, and then come in and mop your room. That's all. I'm not I'm not lying when I'm saying this right. So I was sat there, let watch them do it and I went because I have a bag of those bacterial wipes. I'm not lying, right? When I had to clean it again because I'm not gonna sweep in it, I might I still could see all the dirt on the floor, so I just went around with the antibacterial wipes at the time because of COVID. Wiped all the my room out, wiped all the surfaces because I didn't even bother with that, cleaned my sink, cleaned all around my bed. And patients shouldn't be doing that. They need to be re trying to recover from whatever they need to recover from, not dealing with someone else's. <laughs> but finally, it's been in the paper about, well, this, in fact, it is a, it's classed as an NHS. No, it is like a NHS, but it's classed as private. It's a private mental health unit. And let me put you down because my blooming arms are killing me. Uh, it's classed... Uh, it's classed as a private hospital. Um, and it's not even far from me. And I've just seen it on my Facebook. Because uh, I don't really use my Facebook, but I went on it anyway just to have a little... See if anyone sent me any messages anyway. So I'm trying to do this so I, I, I can stay focused for you guys. So, anyway, <laughs> I'm like, finally, something is getting done. The mental health system is so needing to be checked because there's so many people now that struggle with their mental health and the hospital staffs are under. Uh, what is it overrun or whatever that says some of the staff are great there now i've had a good experience with some but mainly like the healthcare workers or especially as one support worker i had i don't even know what i did wrong i don't think she just liked me full stop uh, i didn't like her after a bit because she just refused to let me go out for a bit of fresh air she just told she was whispering and you know when you get paranoid anyway but I was to other patients telling other patients your business which I think is bang out of order. Anyhow, um, I didn't like her either, so there we go. But it's finally getting investigated. Now the government needs to get off the backside, do something now, and maybe get some people out, trained up properly. Some of the nurses are not going to lie, are really good. Some just don't give two hoots. Um, in the private one that I was in, um, you got more support of the cleaning staff, which is wrong, you know what I mean? You got more, you talk more to them, and they understood, then you would, half the staff, half the staff were never in the uh, actual unit uh, where we were. So you just sat left to your own devices. So finally, they're taking note, and something is getting, this particular hospital is getting investigated. Finally. Finally, and I'm put, I, I don't know what it is with, I think it's the medication. It's making me want to eat all day long. Oh, oh, sorry, my shoulder's hurting. It's just making me want to eat. And I know people, um, doctor's like, well, it you fibro if you've got, if you're 
put on weight and I can't help it. You're giving me medication, it's making me gain, it's making me want to heat and I ain't got <laughs> I need the energy, you know what I mean? I need to eat something, but it's the wrong things. So yeah. Anyway guys, I'm gonna feel leave you on leave you uh, on for now because I feel like I need to go and lay down because I do actually feel really, really tired. Oh, like damn fibro, you know, it's it ruins your life. A chronic illness, you just can't do what you want to do. So damn you fibro, damn you fight mental health. But I'm, I'm glad that the hospital's getting investigated. Anyhow, don't forget to hit that like button, it does mean a lot. It helps with the health of the rhythm as well. It helps push out my video if you comment and stuff like that. So if I'm engaging with you, it does help my videos get out there so a lot more people can get to see this ugly face joking don't ever <laughs> don't ever dish yourself anyway hit that like button subscribe if you haven't already and that notification bell so you don't miss any further uploads and i'll see you in the next video Bye bye